text sharp. How do you, all of them. Mexico City is so beautiful right now. The jacarandas are in bloom and every street you turn down, you're greeted by these beautiful purple trees. And it's really, really magical. I had a, I had a lot of photo plans and things I wanted to make. I was even gifted my first, my very first black and white film role and was gonna focus on creating shoots with that. I felt pretty good. I felt like I was finally getting organized. I was optimistic about, you know, everything and I was getting pumped and I was gonna photograph flowers, you know, subtle quiet scenes around the house and, you know, beautiful shadows and silhouettes. And yeah, I was getting ready to prep and, and get started with everything. But my expectations didn't line up with reality. I got really sick with food poisoning and was out of commission for about two full weeks. Couldn't barely eat anything. And I, I felt like I was missing out on all the things I wanted to photograph. I lost a lot of weight, despite having friends, you know, push me to eat. I was impatient to feel normal again. But I kept trying to take small walks. And when I had more energy, I would indulge in some stupidity, like cut my own hair with kitchen scissors. <laughs> um, you know, just... You know, you succumb to insanity a little bit. Eventually I succumbed to patience. And one day I woke up and felt just a bit better. But by the time I did, I had to pack up and leave again. I felt sad for all the time that I lost. It felt like there had been so much potential and then it was you know, just gone. But that's the funny thing sometimes. You know, rarely, rarely reality matches up with expectations. They could be worse, or they could be better than you thought. And I started to feel that ro rose-colored glasses aren't necessarily bad. You just have to keep yourself grounded and take long, hard looks around you. So now I've moved into my new place in Portales in Mexico City. I'm trying to find my footing again, and I feel like I'm on some sort of path. Um, so, yeah, let's see where it leads. <laughs>